uh, my dear colleague Mahisi Rabia will be back uh, uh, shortly with the second uh, topic here in the program. Uh, and that topic will be the We Are All One initiative uh, launched under the auspices of His Excellency President Assisi uh, as uh, the government tries to ease the uh, living conditions of citizens uh, ahead of the holy month uh, of Ramadan. Um, and, uh, but before that, let's watch this uh, report. Uh, uh, as the Faculty of Mass Communication, Cairo University, organized a symposium on media and women's issues in the New Republic as part of the celebration of International Women's Day earlier this uh, month, of course. Um, the symposium discussed women's issues in the New Republic, women and women empowerment, which is one of the top priorities of Egypt's 2030 vision. Now, LTV International's Minna Dusui was there and filed in this report. of the International Women's Day, Faculty of Mass Communication, Cairo University, organized a symposium on media and women's issues in the New Republic under the auspices of Dr. Mohammed Osman al khusht President of Cairo University, as part of an annual celebration. <laughs> The media has a major role in drawing attention to women's issues and focusing on them during the coming period and not delving into problems that stray from basic issues, especially those related to the role of women and the new republic and the role of media is supportive and influential significantly in drawing attention to community issues. The symposium witnessed a wide turnout from the professors of the faculty and the participants invited the female journalists and female media professionals and pioneers. Salut, Hussein, it's a pleasure to have you with me uh, on the occasion of Women's International Day. Uh, what do you say to all the women around the world, especially Egyptian women, and how uh, the Egyptian women uh, nowadays uh, live a glorious life under the leadership of His Excellency President Abdel Fattah Sisi? I say uh, happy International Women's Day. I'm really thrilled to be honored today uh, by the Faculty of uh, Mass Communication, Cairo University. It's a great honor. And I thank very much uh, Dr. Huayda Mustafa, the Dean uh, of the Faculty, for honoring me on that special occasion. Uh, well, uh, as you know, uh, that uh, uh, lots of achievements have been uh, actually taking place under the leadership of President Abdel Fattah Sisi. Lots of achievements for women, women in the different walks of life and recently also in the field of judiciary. So uh, responding to your question concerning a message on my behalf, I would say that uh, happy Women's Day always uh, to the lovely women watching us. Uh, believe in yourself, believe in your dream and go after it because uh, you deserve the best and definitely if there is a will there is always a way. Okay, thank you and congratulations. Thank you so much, Min. Okay. The women's issues come at the top priorities of the state's pioneering policies for justice as and good representation of women in order to pay attention to their issues in the field of education and empowering to the leading role in the society. The Egyptian state include the need to develop media interests in women's issues, especially in the light of the digital transformation and challenges that are currently emerging on the scene and require strengthening the role of women raising their status and overcoming their own obstacles and raising awareness of both their rights and roles. At the end, the ceremony honored each of the faculty members, participants and media figures in appreciation for the role of the college and media in adopting women's issues and drawing attention of the media to it. Praise and appreciation to all the women around the world, especially Egyptian women, for throughout the history she is a caring mom, a virtuous wife, a daughter who fills life with joy and happiness. Happy International Women's Day. Menna Bissou Inal TV International.